Hello everybody, my name is Hammock. Sorry if I sound a bit sick, I've been, well, ill recently for like the last few months. Um, I wanted to make a little video about something interesting I've noticed with Chen, watching TI, uh, Bet Boom vs Liquid. It was a Chen game. Anytime there's a Chen game being played in the professional scene, I like to just check it in case anything interesting happens and something interesting did happen it's quite minor but i think it's interesting enough that i'm definitely going to update my guide so i'm watching toronto Tok tokyo play chan the game's going pretty well i'm just gonna have this go along in the background basically i might actually need to turn down a little bit basically whenever i play chan um i tend to go you see my like guide here on the side here I'll go like a wand, and then I'll get like either a bracer or a null talisman. I've been going bracer recently because bracer is very strong. Um, and then I go either into like Vlad's or mech. Like you have like a Vlad's if you want to play like a long fight. Um, and let me pause here. You you play Vlad's if you want to have like a long fight and you think you can like outlast it and you can play like very high tempo. But you get mech if someone like is going to jump on you and kill you. So like. If you don't expect you're going to be there the whole fight to give a lot of like Vlad's value, then you can have your mech value, you can pop your ultimate, you die, and you still feel like you like did something as opposed to getting an item that needs you to be there for it to have value and then you're just not there, right? So it's nice to have something like Bracer as well to give you some extra chunk so you don't get bursted down. Now I noticed something interesting this game. Toronto Tokyo just a second ago, he's eyeing up getting a Vladimir. Uh, See on the sticky, getting Vlad and goes, wait, I'm going to get Solo Crest later on anyway, because Solo Crest is going to be really good. It'll be good with like the Treant, with the Ironwood Treant. It's really good to pull on a lot of these carries, like Conker and Alchemist, and also synergize as well Chen anyway. You put Solo Crest on an ally, and then you Penitence an enemy, and then you get insane amounts of attack speed. But because they know they're going to go Solo Crystal later after Vlad's, they instead buy a crown right now and then go back to building Vlad's. And I think this is interesting. It's very, it's very small. But I think it's interesting because this could potentially be a decent replacement for buying a Bracer or a Null Talisman if you know you're going to be building Solo Crest that game. So it might not work every game. Braces are especially still very, very good value. Like, they give you a lot of HP. I think it's about, like, 200 and th like 50, 260 HP, I think, when it's, like, level tw uh, minute 25. I could be wrong. Um, so if you have, like, the space in your inventory and you, like, just need a filler item, braces are, like, very nice. But obviously, this is professional play. They don't necessarily need a filler item. They want to optimize everything. So Crown gives pretty good stats. It gives a plus four to all attributes. And Chen is universal. So I did a little math here. I could be wrong because I'm a bit of a dummy. But let me look at the items here. So... The Bracer gives plus 5 to Strength, plus 2 to Agility, and plus 2 to Intelligence. This adds up to 9 total stats. Universal Heroes gain damage equal to, I think, every stat uh, point in a stat gives 0. 0.7 damage. So, a Bracer gives 9 total stats, which gives 6.3 damage to Chen as like base damage for like right-clicking. Now, the crown, where is it? Uh, somewhere around here, there it is, uh, gives plus four to all attributes, which adds up to 12 total stats, I think. Unless it's just four in total, which would be a bit confusing. I'm going to assume it's 12, uh, which then gives Chen 8.4 damage. Now, this is just looking at damage. If you take Bracer, you're going to get more health and health regen overall. And if you get Null Talisman, you're going to get more Intelligence, you're going to get more Mana, Mana Regen. You also get the bonus of the, um, where is it? there it is. You also get the Max Mana bonus and the Max, uh, and the Mana Regen. But if you have situations where you're buying these items and then later on, you're putting them in your backpack because you need to be holding wards, you need to be holding dust, you've got all these extra aura items on hand, 
then they may not be as value as getting something like a crown which has good early value it gives you better damage and it gives you a decent spread of the attributes that you want and you know you're going to be using it to build something like a solar crest you can also build into a shivas i guess if you wanted to go that route but i don't know if that's necessarily a good route on chen it could be i don't know but either way i thought that would be that's kind of interesting and uh yeah okay see ya